house. It's bedded down right now. I probably read it all night long, but we got a great opportunity to plant a stock on him, so we're gonna go with it and see if we can get him. Did I did I knock him on his ass? Oh man! Oh. oh, we just sat here. We what a stock we made. Oh. <laughs> Come back from over here around. I bet we sit here for an hour, if not longer. Good lord! On hands and knees. 
and it paid off. Frankie, look at this. Oh man, Mike. Look at that. Look at that buck. Oh, oh. oh man. Oh, he's done. Isn't he? Look at this, would you? He is done. Look at that. Man, oh man. <laughs> Five by four. Isn't he? That's a nice buck. Yeah. Oh man. Hey, uh, there ain't no fences here. This is all, this is real as it gets right here. Whew, boy, he smells good, don't he? Oh, well, man. folks, here we are in Southern Idaho on our uh, late muzzleloader hunt. It, uh, what is today? It's the 9th of November. We worked hard this year. We got, uh, John's got one down already. A nice four point, nice one. We've seen this one first thing this morning. Right up here on top, we spotted him coming up over this ridge right here, chasing some does, and uh, ended up in this bottom. It's where he was gonna hang out all day. We seen where he bedded down, uh, planned a stock, started off clear up at the head of this canyon and worked our way all the way down. Got within 100 yards of him. Waited till he got up to stretch, about one o'clock, and smoked him. Yeah, yeah, you put a heck of a shot on him. I mean, he just, he dropped in his tracks. I mean, he didn't move, he just dropped. A 405 grain power belt bullet did, did a job. <laughs> yeah, but, you know, another stock, you know, on hands and knees, um, crawling. We did what it took to get, get in the 100 yards and it paid off. Boy, did it pay off. Look at this buck. Fine, fine buck, Mike. Public land, do it yourself. There ain't no fences here. <laughs>